everyone, Ariel Adams here with the blog to watch. Please subscribe to our videos on YouTube and like this video if you find it useful. This is a review of the Uniform Wears 351. This is technically the 351-RG01. Um, this is, you know, for the most part, what I call a minimalist watch. Um, Uniform Wears is the type of company that does some interesting things, and what they do is they take a lot of classic sort of watch design elements, and they sort of try to uh, deconstruct it to its minimum. One of the characteristics of this brand is the fact that you don't have any um, brand name on the dial. So if you look at the back of the watch, um, it is going to say uh, the name the name of the company on there. I just took the sticker off there, so it's a little little bit of stuff that cleans right off. Um, but on the dial, you have a very clean um, look, and that's sometimes called a sterile look. So in the watch world, um, when you don't have a logo, it's called a, uh, or any text on the dial, it's called a sterile dial. Um, this is unique among the 351 collection watches um, because it has a subsidiary seconds hand and design. So very few of the uniform wears timepieces, even in the same collections, look exactly the same. Um, though there are some that just have uh, color differences. This is what is this is a dress watch. Um, and as you can see that it is quite attractive um, if, the, if you like that sterile type of look. The case size is 39 millimeters wide and it has sort of this, um, it's almost like a deep brown dial. Um, the case is sort of a PVD rose gold, it's steel. Um, and I love the hands there and everything like that. It's just a very attractive look um, and it makes for an interesting design when you're not particularly interested in showing a brand name. Um, for a quartz watch, the quality is very, very good, and that's one of the things that, that separates uniform wares is the fact that um, it, is, it is a brand that, at least right now, makes quartz watches, but the quality is much higher than you'd find on other quartz watches. Even on the buckle there, even though it's a unique buckle, there's no brand name, anything like that. And that's something that the, that the, the, the designers of the brand, it's an English brand, this is something they just wanted to do. They wanted to have a watch where it wasn't about um, the name on the watch, but it was about the design so I guess you could say it's, it's very much a design lover's watch um, for people that are into design and art and things like that. But even, even people are watch lovers who just want to enjoy the look of something without having a specific brand name associated to it. This is a very interesting thing and I think the quality is, is very well done. Um, overall I like it and I think the brand um, has a lot of interesting unique things and I, I do like where they're going especially where they're, uh, mo they're moving their production to Switzerland. So they're going to be um, really up there with a sort of high-end quartz watch movement um, that I think uh, I think is due. I think there's definitely a market for that. Again, this is the Uniform Wears 351, uh, and the price for this in uh, in British pounds is 530 pounds. But if you buy it outside of England, um, or I guess outside of Europe, you you pay less because there's no VAT. So you'll have to go to their website to see exactly um, what that is. And you can see the full review of this Uniform Wears watch on a blog to watch. Thanks.